Hawthorne, California-based space exploration technology SpaceX has released animation of the upcoming launch of one of the company Falcon Heavy rockets lifting off from Kennedy Space Center's Launch Complex 39A in Florida. SpaceX and other aerospace firms have released a lot of animation, however, at about 41 seconds in, this latest video begins to go off the usual script. The video shows what could be one of the most spectacular changes in terms of heavy lift attempted to date. Designed in a similar layout as the United Launch Alliance's Delta IV Heavy, the Falcon Heavy is of a triple body design. Much like the liquid boosters on the Delta IV Heavy about a minute and a half into the flight, the two sides boosters are jettisoned. This is where things break from the traditional script. The booster write themselves and conduct a controlled ballistic reentry, side by side. The two boosters then return to what is likely Cape Canaveral Air Force Station Space Launch Complex 13, and land on two of what appear to be five landing sites at the complex. Each of these landing sites, is marked with a large X then the lone central core, having completed its mission, readjusts its heading, and heads back to Earth where it lands. The video bears some resemblance to one issued by NASA of the space agency's new heavy lift booster, the Space Launch System or SLS. To date, SpaceX has come very close to carrying out the all-important last step of landing on a solid platform. During the January 10th flight of the company Falcon 91.1, the booster made it all the way to a landing barge placed out in the Atlantic Ocean some 200 miles off the coast of Florida. However, the booster's first stage struck the barge and burst into flames. Being able to return the first stage and its precious rocket engines back to Earth will forever change the spaceflight landscape as it will mean that a large portion of what was once single use can now be reused. SpaceX has stated that it plans to carry out the first launch of the Falcon Heavy later this year. While the company has redefined how launches are conducted having 27 of its Merlin 1D engines work in unison, is very different from the 9 that are used in the Falcon 91 .1. Similarly, landing three booster cores is very different than landing just one. Given that SpaceX has developed the pattern of doing exactly what it says it will do, many aerospace analysts are giving the newspace firm the benefit of the doubt. The coming year could be a very important one for SpaceX. Not only does the company plan to carry out the test flight of the Falcon Heavy, it also plans to conduct the critical path abort test of its Dragon Vita spacecraft in March and has some 17 missions on its manifest, with four taking place from Vandenberg Air Force. Bases Space Launch Complex 4